Do you want to put more money in your pocket? You may walk dogs, work at Starbucks, or hire a clown costume and work at children's birthday parties. Alternatively, you might simply relax on the couch and open your laptop. Okay, it isn't quite that simple. However, because to the booming gig economy and the internet's vast reach, there are more options than ever before to watch the Benjamins, or at least Abrahams, roll in from the comfort of your own home. Check out these five digital side hustles to get started making money online from home. They're a little out there, but they don't require any special abilities, are completely legal, and will help you enhance your bottom line. Virtual Bridesmaid Saying I do is big business for everyone from caterers to bands to florists. And now there's a new market in the $58 billion wedding industry, where you could make some money. Bridesmaid for Hire is a company that provides professional bridesmaid services. While some of the activities entail helping out on the big day, or even serving as a bridesmaid, the majority of the responsibilities are accomplished online. Organizing the bridal shower and bachelorette party, managing RSVPs, and working as an on-call therapist and peacekeeper when wedding drama flares up are just a few of the responsibilities. What's going on in your lane? Fill out the site's application, which matches brides and bridesmaids based on personality and location. You may earn anything from $200 to $2,000 per month working anywhere from a few hours per month to a few hours per week, and you'll typically manage everything on nights and weekends. The majority of projects, er, weddings, take 3 to 11 months to complete. Sell your skills. There are numerous freelancing websites where people can sell their skills. However, because to its millions of users and stunningly simple principle, Fiverr is the go-to destination. Fiverr, rather than serving as a labor market, functions as an e-commerce platform where services are sold as products. There's a market for practically every skill, from graphic design and web development to songwriting and astrology reading, with over 100 categories to select from. Include data about the breadth of your offering, your availability, and cost when posting a gig. While many gigs start at $5, Fiverr keeps 20%, Sellers can design a tiered pricing plan for a single service, offering excellent, better, and best options. When a buyer provides a review after receiving a gig, you gain credibility and a reputation. Your salary will vary greatly depending on your level of experience and available time. Fiverr's Marketplace caters to the freelance moonlighter with 10 hours a week to spare, as well as the professional who relies on this as a primary source of income. Some top sellers earn more than $100,000 per year. Get paid to hang out online. It's called search engine evaluation, and if you spend a lot of your free time on the internet, this could be a great job for you. What exactly is it about? To give reliable results, Google, Yahoo, and Bing use complicated algorithms. They do, however, run the results by humans to ensure that they are relevant. If you type in banana bread recipe, for example, Search engines should bring up recipes from big websites first. Smaller blog posts and recipes for related meals, such as zucchini bread, should be near the bottom of the list. As a search engine evaluator, you'll be asked to type in specific words or phrases into a search engine, and then evaluate how relevant and helpful the sites it returns are. Two prominent firms that hire search engine evaluators are Leapforce and Appen Butler Hill. Appen also employs social media evaluators, who assess a company's social media news stream for relevance. Potential workers must fill out an application, project-specific screenings, and language proficiency tests may be required, and candidates must take and pass a three-part qualifying exam at Appen. Both organizations also require a modern computer, smartphone, high-speed internet, antivirus software, specific operating systems, and a basic understanding of the internet. The site's hourly rates are estimated to be in the $13 to $14 range by Glassdoor, despite the fact that they aren't publicly disclosed. Although the employment isn't always constant, it might be a good side hustle. Help kids ace exams. Tutoring services like Tutor, Scully, Wizant, and Chegg are looking for patient, creative people who are eager to use their knowledge of a subject to help students, college students, and adults grasp it. To be recruited, you must complete an application and pass a knowledge test. If you pass, you go through a sample session with an experienced tutor who plays the part of a student and evaluates your creativity, empathy, and teaching skills. This site search for people who are knowledgeable about their subject and can effectively break it down and communicate.
you'll be matched with a student who can submit questions, essays, or homework difficulties that they need help with once you've signed up. In an online classroom, you'll collaborate by sharing files back and forth and holding conversations on a shared whiteboard. You can work part-time and choose your own hours. Teachers at Tutor are paid between $9 and $14 per hour, according to Glassdoor. Depending on the subject mix and number of hours you work, you may make anything from a few hundred to a few thousand dollars per month. Chegg's prices begin at $20 per hour, with tutors earning up to $1,000 per month. According to Glassdoor, Wizant's fees range from $24 to $36 per hour. Rent your parking space. If you reside in a big city and have a parking place, you may make some additional money by renting it out to other cars while you're at work or on vacation. ParkX in Chicago, Spot and Spot on Parking in various U.S. locations, and Parking Spotter Countrywide are also available to help. It's simple to create a listing. On Spot, you pin your parking spot on the site's map, take a photo of it, set your availability and rate. Most sites will provide a rough estimate and choose a payment option, such as direct deposit or PayPal. When your spot is rented, the website charges a 20% commission. And you didn't even have to raise a finger to fatten your wallet. As always thank you for watching, if you like this video give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and ring the notification bell so you won't miss out any of my future videos.